everybody, what's up? Welcome back to Card Curiosity, where we try to find the best possible ways to get a good return on your investment in the sports card world. And I'm back with uh, something I haven't really done before, uh, but this is just going to be a recap video of everything we got from the 2023 Bowman University Best case. And the, the video of us opening the case ended up taking quite a bit of time, so I didn't want to do this on the uh, on that particular video. I thought maybe we could take five five minutes or so here and just do a quick rundown of everything that was hit. And man, I, again, it's just still, it's still fresh in my mind. It's, it's still crazy, all the good stuff that came from these 12 boxes. So as a reminder, our, our initial investment on this um, was close to $3,800, I believe, after shipping and tax, um, you know, around three, 30 to 350 per box you get 12 boxes and the the end result is you know four autographs per box and you can see i've got every box kind of laid out as how how they came out um, these are all the autographs and all of the numbered cards and so uh, off to the side over here you can see that's all the the base and the refractors and everything else so there's there's a lot a lot of goodies that came out of this and I mean, it, it might be one of the most obvious good return on your investment kind of products that we've ever seen. And so um, I'm not going to take too much time here. I just want to show you again visually what all it was kind of box by box so you can just see all the good stuff that came. So, you know, when it comes to autographs, again, we had the four per box. In this one, we had, you know, Joe Milton to 25. We had a Will Howard to 50. We had a Jordan Travis to 75. Um, Jacob Cowing, who I'm unfamiliar with. So every now and then you're going to get a guy that you're not sure about. There's a nice Shooter Sanders uh, to 99 and um, another numbered card there. Somebody we're unfamiliar with, even though, you know, you get four autos per box. What I was not expecting was two bonus autos on in the case, which, of course, are in the back here. The, the, the Jersey autos, the massive patch autos are, you know, they're really thick. And they were in addition to the four autographs that already came in those particular boxes. So um, there was actually, instead of 48 autographs, 50. We had 50 of them. And those were, um, those were pretty surprising as well. So this other box we had, Shadur, you know, Patch Auto, not numbered, um, but still pretty sick. Uh, Joe Milton, the 25 on the uh, Gunslingers. You had a Dante Moore Masterpieces, which is nice. And then justice ellison that's just a i think a regular refractor and then a couple numbered cards here um box number three and i don't know if these are necessarily in order i'm just showing you one at a time counting them out so joe alt um to five donovan edwards uh caleb downs dallin hayden to 50 and then a couple uh numbered cards here dante moore barnes and uh somebody else I'm not familiar with. So um, we had, of course, the just the absolutely crazy box that had the Marvin Harrison dual auto um, with uh, Buka. And as a Buckeye fan, that that might be one of the coolest cards I've ever, ever seen, let alone held in my hands, let alone just pulled from a box. So got McMillan, another good uh, receiver. Vizina to 50. McCord. 25 and then quite a few um numbered cards here nothing too crazy other than that uh jordan travis to 25 so the hits keep coming with this product you know marv to 75 in box five here um this guy i'm unfamiliar with but to 25 um that's nice you got another patch auto of somebody i'm unfamiliar with uh dylan gabriel to 50 he's He's going to be a pretty good quarterback for Oklahoma. A couple extra numbered ones there. So you can see, you know, typically you get the four autos and you get anywhere from two to, to four um, parallels and stuff. So uh, you got maybe maybe the weakest box here. You had uh, Makuba, Prentice to 25. He did have one to 10, 10 out of 10, which is pretty cool. I'm just not real familiar with the player. And then Travis Hunter, um, just a base auto, but Travis Hunter, of course, is... Fantastic. You got a Michigan guy here, um, 25 out of 25. And then Antonio Gates. 
Going to the back here, you had a Cade Klubnik to 25, Jason Marshall to 50, Ty Simpson to 50. Um, oh, that, the last autograph here was Tyleek Williams, Buckeye to 50. I just have that sleeved up. Um, we also have this Caleb Williams back here, and that's not numbered, so I won't really count that. Um, Haynes and another Shadur on the numbered card, which, I mean, again, just, just crazy stuff. Almost every box here I think we could sell off and, and get our money back. This was also a, a ridiculous box. You have two Brock Bowers autos, one to 10, kind of a color match there. Second one is a Masterpieces to 75. Got Ruben to 25 here, uh, another Kobe Prentice, uh, JRP to 100, and Drew Aller, color match to 150. Um, four, four boxes left. KJ Jefferson to five. I was really surprised how many how many autographs we got that were numbered to five or less, if I'm being honest. Um, I think there was three at least. Um, and then even 10 and less. Uh, there was another couple. Aller, Vizina, another one. Uh, Dane Key. Um, we had a Studious Stars of uh, Bo Nix to 25, which is really nice. And the JJ McCarthy color match there kind of on, on that one. And over here, three boxes left. A Bo Nix autograph. Nice to, to find one of those. Refractor. Ty Simpson. SD, Esteem. Somebody. Oh, maybe I missed an autograph in this one. So um, perhaps the Mbuka might have come in this particular pack. Um, yeah, if it's not here. Another uh, Bo Nix. Studious there uh you've got a georgia guy out to 50 there and then caleb williams to 150 so um i think the drake may was the only one where you actually got an extra autograph um surprisingly uh didn't expect that but it was really cool cam rising to five that's absolutely beautiful um kendall milton 25 chop to 50 another reuben and then you have the kind of the inserts here fear the spear that's to 50 uh, another Shadur, so I'm, I'm thrilled to be getting lots of Shadur cards. You know, he, he always sells well, and um, I expect him to do big things next year. Uh, and then finally, the last box, Dante Moore. Um, unnumbered, I believe, on the patch auto, but still pretty solid. Dylan Gabriel to 25, that's great. McKinstry, Kool-Aid to 50. Newbin to 50. Then you got Georgia, Boy, Milton, and uh, uh, Frank Gore Jr. to 75. So um, that is, that's what we got. But again, those are just the hits. No refractors, no speckles, no no nothing. And of course, I think the, the absolute two coolest cards here perhaps are these patch autos. A three-color patch auto for Drake May to 49. Um, a two-color auto of Emeka, who I love now that Marv's leaving. He's going to be the guy. And then I think maybe the, the best card of them all right here. That's that's just insane. So love it. Um, what a product. Can't recommend it enough. If you can find it, you know, don't pay up. Don't pay an unlimited amount for it. But um, man, you're you're going to find some good stuff. And, you know, we'll see over the next few weeks how the, you know, the resale value holds up. But again, my, my play for this is to, you know, as soon as possible, I'm going to be selling off anybody who's not either in my personal collection. So I'm looking for Buckeyes. I'll keep the Buckeyes. Um, and I might keep maybe the top, top prospects for 2025. But everything else I kind of want to sell because I don't really want to sit on these when there's other products coming out to potentially um, buy and invest in. The guys that are going to be drafted here soon, uh, I will, I'll be grading and we'll send them to PSA. We'll hopefully get some good grades and get some PSA 10s just in time for the NFL draft. And I expect their value in that case to go up quite a bit by then. So hope you enjoyed this kind of recap. Sorry, it's, it's a little bit slow, nothing new being opened. But I wanted you to understand what the potential is here. Hope you liked it and stay curious. Bye.